Hello guys, my name is JP. Welcome back to Civilization 5, Brave New World. We are in the middle of the war with the Moroccans. We are we're honestly whooping them. We easily took one of their cities with no problem. Using our our, our much our very powerful navy. And they're trying to take it back, but it's, like I keep saying, it's not going to happen. They have, like, zero chance. We can go ahead and start moving the other half of the navy over to this way. To set up to take, uh, Tangier. We will have two frigates and three privateers on hand to take the city. Should be plenty. There's actually only one spot to to, uh, to directly sea attack from, so it's useless anyways taking all those. Taking all the extra privateers. It's really so I can like attack with one, switch it out, attack with another one, switch it out. So I don't, uh, get any single one of them killed. Oh, we repelled them. That's for sure. Uh, let's go ahead and buy a couple of things here. Okay, workshop. Uh, what else do they need? I don't want to buy the courthouse. That seems like a waste, because they're about to build it anyways. Oh, I don't have enough gold for the factory. Okay, I'll wait for a factory. This will be like the one place that really needs it. They want to give me Fez for peace. Mm, no. And they know they're going to lose, that's why. Because they've lost like 75% of their military. Between them trying to attack... Nice. Oh, I can choose, uh, an ideology, finally. So you'll finally get to see what that's about. I'm gonna go ahead and leave this frigate here. Heal up this one and take it around to the other side. What was the previous one? Actually, Casablanca could really use it. up. Frigate. I don't want to move it within range where it's going to get shot right away. I'm just wasting the moves. Just production. Military base is good. Public school, please. Military base. Choose ideology. Basically, this is what it is. It's like the the three in-game uh, policies like you had before. Like now you have. I'll show you the details. For autocracy, wounded you know, wounded military units inflict 25% more damage. Gold purchasing for units is reduced by 33%. City-states would uh, grant units twice as often. 100 plus 100 tourism, local happiness, stuff like this. It's it's the policies, but redone. And I definitely want autocracy. Uh, I would like to choose a host, please. I would like it to be me. And you cannot you cannot argue that because you got no votes, guy. You suck. Alright, we can go to Ideology, I believe, and we get two of them for free. So the first one I definitely want... Oop. I probably want the extra happiness again.
Hmm. Well, the wounded units would probably work good too. And for the second one, we can do. I want to say gold purchasing because I have a habit of buying units at the last second when I need them, but I'm going to try to set up against that this time. I guess every national wonder. I have a lot of them. And the next one we get to level 2, they, un they unlock like a, like a tree. So for every two you get one of these, for every two of these you get one of these. So hopefully we'll get them pretty quick. They count as uh, policies. So I'll have one in three turns, it says, so that's not bad. Japan remains host, sucker. You got nothing. Alright, let's go ahead and move it up here and see if I can take a shot. I can. We don't need a privateer anymore. I'm gonna go send him off as a sentry defense. Another shot. Who is the strongest one? This one is the closest to leveling up, I believe. Yep. give him some more targets in case he decides to start shooting. They won't always attack the closest one, they'll often attack the, the strongest one, like they might attack my frigates and stuff first. Which isn't the best move on their part, but that's what they want to do. Military base. I do want to watch this though, because I think they're going to get attacked. Whoa, what was that? Yes, he's attacking for some reason attacking this one. It's not even doing anything, it's just there. No longer al ally of Panama. Okay, I need to buy Panama back. I think it's... This one? No. This one? This one? This one, okay. Give a gift. One thousand gold. Cool. Just production. Yeah, see, they're able to build pretty quick now. So let's go ahead and give them some of the basics. Need to set up a sentry here. That's a pretty good big, big view. This guy is going to take your worker because you're stupid. Tangier, please. You too. You see right here I can switch out, but this guy's doing pretty good, so I'm gonna let him keep on with it. Alert for that one. Next turn. Oh we have an, we have another spy. Okay, I need to get to that next. We lost one. That's unfortunate. That's why we have extras. Oh, we took knocked the shit out of that guy. Alright, where is our admiral? It had to be way over here, of course. The opposite side of the world from where we need it. Let's do all this stuff first. Arsenal. Oh, uh, we need to give them a... We need, they need walls, definitely. We have... Their ideology. Level 2 will give us... Movement... Maintenance cost, that's what I want to reduce. Or I can go with... Uh, faster production of new units. And 15 experience. Or I can reduce the quantity of the resources I have. But I think right now I'd rather have the reduced cost. 
Uh, we can send this extra frigate around. Probably as another sentry, he'll be probably right here at the edge of this island. We need to send our admiral out. I need him over here. It's gonna take freaking forever. Go ahead and let them take their shots. It's very possible that this guy can finish this. We have a winner. Uh, but do I want it? I guess it makes sense to annex their cities. I have no reason not to. Like, it's not like they're right next to my city and I just want the space. No, I, I just want their cities. I have a knight there, but that's not much of a problem. One knight isn't going to take the, the city back that fast. Because the cannon they had inside the city just stops existing when that happens. I'm going to take up that crossbow with one of the frigates. They're still trying, they still have a little bit of a military, but nowhere near enough for any kind of fighting anymore. They're, they're basically dead in the water. They lost this war pretty fast when they tried to take uh, Casablanca back. I don't believe they have any trade routes left, so I can just uh, kind of hang out, I guess. Production, police stations. Oh, yeah, that's what I forgot to do. The other. This guy needs an assignment. Move him to. Hmm. If I move him to Bucharest, he'll, uh... Basically, if I move him to a... a city-state, it'll take care of me having to... pay them off and stuff. Which I... Which is what I'd prefer. I'd rather not spend money on city-states. I don't mind helping them out and stuff, but when they start costing me money, it's like, eh... Oh. Fez is our major ground target. Once we take uh, Fez, I think we'll be pretty good. Tangier can fire on you, because you're stupid. Let's go ahead and have this guy shoot. See, I've already taken two of their cities. Wait. This guy was already alerted, so what's going on here? Something must have come through for it to unalert. Hmm. This guy be the only one that gets a factory. So I need him to be able to produce units as fast as possible for when I attack Fez. And I'm still pretty sure they have... Yeah, they have other cities up here. That I'm going to have to deal with. Landlocked cities. I think I can go here just fine. Hit that privateer of theirs. It's an enemy is near, but it's not telling me where. Oh, it's just right here. It's just a worker. It's not really an enemy. Enemy. I'll kill him if you want, but it doesn't seem right. and keep hitting their privateer there. Police station. Yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good now. We've pretty much wiped out their military. So it's just a matter of time.
Oh, okay, now there actually is something to shoot at. They had a, uh, a crossbow guy there. I wonder what they're up to. They're suddenly moving around like they're like they have a plan. Let's see if I can uh, take their privateer with my privateer. That's the advantage of privateers. They don't always destroy the ship. They sometimes capture it. Military base. Production police station. Armory's good. Choose research. Submarines are very nice. We'll go with fertilizer though, because it's telling me to do fertilizer. I have discovered oil. Okay, somebody needs to go get that. I don't think we have any use for oil yet though. Musician. Interesting. Let's see if I can hit that from here. Indeed, I can. Just eliminate all their units. Don't even give them a chance. catchy. Okay, we'll go ahead and leave... We won't leave him here. We'll need him to take the... take their capital. We can, however, take this privateer that's been sitting here and move him there. That is reasonable defense. Heal up. Hospital. Next turn. We're waiting on Casablanca for a lot of things at this point. Been promoted. Uh, we don't really need that much more unit movement. Bombardment 2 is useful though. Holy crap, they have another city back here. Out of nowhere, holy shit. Okay, I'm gonna shoot at that. And this one needs to come down here and help me with it. I wasn't expecting another city. Uh, it's just out of nowhere. That's where that unit came from then. Was I thought I was just going crazy. Still not gonna happen. You wanted war and you got it. You guys all saw it the last episode. He called me out. He was like, well you have a lot of military on my borders. You just passing through or are you gonna start a war? Well, if you want war, you got it. Let me just get off my keys, man. I've been sitting on my keys in my back pocket for the past hour. It's starting to hurt. This one will probably just raise it though, because uh, we don't need another little city right here. Caravan. Mm, Hong Kong seems right. It's not getting any, in we don't get any influence on it, for us it doesn't make any difference either way. If we were getting influence, I would need it to be with uh, Panama, because we had problems with that before. This guy is getting ready to die. So I'm going to pull him back. Fortify. I'll move this one up too so I can take double shots for a while. This little one here is actually harder to take than I would think. I guess because it's so locked in that I don't have any way to really attack at it. 
Uh, hospital first. Hospital. Just production. Arsenal. Do they have like forces and stuff here? Yeah, they do. Okay. Gotta watch this one. I don't trust these guys. At least uh, playing as Japanese, I always attack at full power, which is my major advantage for war here. Dump it into research. Oh, we finally got the... Finally got that Admiral, like, 50 turns later. Where'd the rest of my Navy go? Didn't I have a whole bunch of ships I brought down? Two... Three... I guess they're just spread out real thin right now. I'll have to, uh, get more ships, I guess. Where? Come on, where? A nation that destroys it. I saw where. Okay. I'm gonna pull this one back, I think. I really don't want to lose a frigate. It's kind of important. I can't even repair this one outside. I'm gonna have to wait for that, uh... For the Admiral to get there. This guy can definitely come around. He's not doing anything up there. Let's go with Dynamite next. Artillery is good for attacking cities. Oh, it didn't even alert me to my, uh... To use my frigate for this. Well, I guess they brought back some military. That's good for them, I suppose. Okay, I'm having problems with taking this one. I'm not going to be able to do that. I'll have to wait for that ironclad to get over here. And that, the Admiral. Once I have the Iron Clan, the Admiral, a little few piece of cake. Let's go ahead and finish up a couple of these. We don't want them to have a cannon at full power, that's for sure. Heal this one up. Pull this one back. Wait for it. Ironclad and come around. Let's get come around through here. Garden. And that'll do it for this episode. I'd like to thank you for watching. My name is JP. And I will see you next time with more Civilization 5 Brave New World, where hopefully we will we will crush the Moroccans. I don't know why. Just, you'll see. Anyways, see you next time.